Andy seemed to seemed to be okay with a homosexual couple being in a homosexual relationship uh, as long as the divorce from the heterosexual uh, relationship was complete. Seemed to. That w that's an interpretation. Uh, but you can go back and watch or listen to When Truth You Met Gracie. And yeah. I think you'd probably come with, to the same conclusion. Yes, 2012. It sounds like Andy Stanley has directly advised gay men to get married. He has said that uh, homosexuals cannot change. He has called homosexuality a disability. He has said that maybe one day he would do a gay wedding. Um, he can't say, but maybe he would. Uh, he believes that uh, pastors should make space for gay people to, to marry. And Luke Simmons and Brian Kruckenberg were both there and publicly corroborated that story. So again, I would ask you, can you validate all of those facts? And would you say this in the presence of God and of Christ Jesus and his chosen angels? Yes, sadly, that is true. All of those facts are true. Wow. Okay. So then I, I think then we need to move to uh, maybe an appeal. Uh, Josh and Ryan, maybe you guys can think about what your appeal would be to Andy and their elders. And I think uh, so I can go first. And I'll just simply say this, I, I appeal to Andy, you owe the body of Christ clarity. Why can't you just clarify this for us? And he has said, I don't good. owe anyone clarity. He said, I don't owe other pastors clarity. And I don't know why he feels that is when he's one of the more influential church leaders in America and he's selling us his books on leadership and communication, communicating for change that he would say he doesn't owe us clarity when his words are creating confusion and he knows that bro just clear this up for us please yeah, yeah. would you just clarify this issue for us